Hi Aries, welcome to my channel. Um, I hope you're doing well. Okay, this reading for today, Aries, this is your next 24 hours reading. Let us see what's happening towards you. What is the message that is meant for you to know? Ready for you to know? This is for the Aries sign, okay? Before I start, I would like to thank you, Aries, for coming back. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you for uh, supporting the channel guest viewers if you haven't clicked the bell click the bell now and click subscribe this reading for today this is your next 24 hours reading let's see what's coming towards you what is the important message for aries please what can i get for love career finance and general situationship this is for the aries sign let us see what's coming towards you guys this is for aries what can i get for aries please okay all right here you go aries you have the knight of cups okay this card wanted to come out and you have the the devil card Ooh, what's happening to your world aries you have the nine of cups okay and you've got the death card okay you have the emperor card which is you and the six of wands and you have the queen of wands and the seven of pentacles let's look at your overall energy for today i'll get you two cards okay um for some of you guys aries you're manifesting um you're manifesting movement okay you're wanting things to move quickly knight of wands the high priestess it's possible that you're manifesting um finance uh financially being stable as quickly as possible for some of you you're manifesting to travel but you're manifesting for things to move in a very uh passionate interactive and really progressive you're mani you're manifesting big progress and not just big progress but fast and progressive you're manifesting that could be you're wanting money to turn maybe you invested something now you want it you want to have result yeah you're manifesting the fastest result and high priestess the knight of wands and i feel like what you want is what you get aries okay so that's a good vibe i feel like you really work hard for this manifestation and i feel like you deserve it whatever you're manifesting you deserve it you're in alignment to get something big aries okay now um you've got the knight of cups in here and you've got the devil card um you know for some of you you're offering love to you're offering support or love to a devil okay um this could be a lover this could be a friend but i really want you to focus on your intuition because you might be blindsided in this you know knight of cups the devil card because it's kind of giving me that you're giving love to someone who's giving you toxic or you're giving something that it's not being reciprocated and it's being abuse you know like knight of cups the devil card you're giving and they're abusing it or you're giving something of a support of a love affection attention but it's not being valued by the devil card okay let's let's put it in here yeah knight of swords and it's time for you to confront it's time for you to ask it's time for really it's time for you to stand up to your ground and really establish a clear boundary towards this person or situation and limit because you're giving something that's not being appreciated valued or it's being wasted knight of swords i feel like I feel like this also this this could also be a person if you confront this person or remind them gently okay take note that you're being diplomatic and you're being gentle about your reminder and they even growl so it will really trigger you to be an aries you know something tells me that yeah like you're very kind hey you know and they even upset with you so something tells me that you're too kind for this person too good you're just giving too much benefits of the doubt you're, you're giving to benefit yeah you're giving 
a lot of benefit of the doubt with this person yeah you're, you're kind of wondering aries queen of pentacles is it worth giving no yeah definitely just to get this two of cups is it worth it you're dealing with the devil and because you want this person's situation to happen even though they're giving you the devil you're still giving them your two of cups in the hope that you'll get something back and you're not they're even angry with you so think very carefully queen of pentacles because you you know you might be wasting your time you need to have a solid decision in here aries is it worth you know is this love worth it is this person worth it whatever you're doing is it worth it to give everything to the devil you know you're losing yourself in here something that you're losing internally you know you're pleasing them and hating yourself some kind of vibe okay so you you gotta recalibrate your energy and fight for fairness okay that's that okay wow so in the next reading is you've got the nine of cups yeah you got the death card in here it's kind of telling me with or without this person with or without this person with or without them with or without the situation you are alive nine of cups i mean you're okay something tells me that you need to let go of people person that brings you down people person situation that never look look at you as someone precious someone amazing they don't look at your value this is not nice nine of cups the death card you're nine of cups and this person bypass you you know like animately could be scorpio but like oops someone is bypassing you someone is not look, looking how beautiful you are how amazing you are your participation your whatever you put in the table it's not being appreciated by this person it's not cool yeah what's the magician card king of wands yeah you've got the six of pentacles in here i mean you know king of wands magician card you're waiting this is you looking into magician card and wait you're waiting for you're waiting for someone to appreciate you to value you like i don't know but i feel like you're waiting for something to turn around and look at you like you're pleasing other people there's something something tells me that this is you you're waiting for the result from this person and this person is already the death card you're waiting for the death to come alive this is dead they can't be a magician so there's something fantasy or there's something not realistic that you're looking into just because you want to please one day it's going to shake you up that you're waiting for something that would never happen so it's just to protect your energy okay so i'm not trying to like kind of scare you or i'm just you know an energy reader here i'm telling you guys if you listen to your intuition it's telling you this is like you're beating a dead horse like you're feeding someone who bites you you know it's like feeding feeding the hand that bites you yeah there's something disrespectful about this person or situation aries it's time to have a wake-up call it's time for you to wake up because um it's not healthy whatever this is you might wake up one day in rage that you have allowed them to blindside you blindsided okay yeah look at that so for some of you guys you are an emperor you are an aries and if there is something that is making you i don't know but if there's something that is pulling you back to where you want to go or what you want to get and you feel like you deserve it six of wands this is something that you can walk away so easily because you are an emperor there's something in this reading Aries that you are not getting it from this person or situation and I don't like it yeah will of fortune you are good if you're alone you are even better if you're alone something tells me it could be a project could be overseas but you are you are not being you're not being seen by this person or situation that you want to be seen you know why because you probably have a competition you know if this is a situation at work there's a lot of i would say you know buttering up your boss or your company to get you know this is whatever you're battling aries it's not anymore about expertise it's not it's not anymore it's not about skills 
it's there's a favoritism in here there's a backstabbing or third party in here because i feel like in this reading aries you're fighting for you're very righteous if you are competing you are competing in a righteous way properly no gossip no buttering up you're just being righteous you're fair when you fight but what you are into is not fair you have a competition and they're doing something behind your back so from from six of pentacles to seven of pentacles this might not be the battle for you you know it's 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 something that you will never win because it's being manipulated okay it's kind of big yeah so if you feel like there's a situation that you keep going over there and there and there and you never won their hearts it's because it's the battle that it's being manipulated it's being orchestrated it's against you although it it, it looks like you're competing for them or it, it feels like you're a team but you're not it's against you yeah there's a hidden energy in here dark low you don't deserve it yes so um this is what i've this is what i have for you aries thank you so much for being here i hope you wake up because i don't want you to you know one day nothing left of you or you're so tired that you have exhausted yourself your energy your life your life your youth to people person situation that doesn't serve the highest purpose and i'll see you soon guys you have a great day bye bye